Alright, I don't think I can wait for the vet's response um, about switching to penicillin. I'm just going to have to give it to him. He may need high doses. Um, 9 milligrams of body weight per pound of body 4.5 milliliters per 100. So, I'm going up. I'm going to give him, I was giving him based on his weight, like half. Uh, it's getting pretty, pretty bad right now. I'm going to go one and a half with a fever of 105. Uh, the latest I checked, point three, we're getting pretty bit on the, on the high end. So, he's not going to like this. He might squeal a little bit. But he needs it. He needs it bad. I know, bud. I know. I know, I know. Come on. That's good. That's good. If you got the energy to cry, that's a good thing. Come on, Prince. You're going to hang in there, right? And you're not going to fail on me. You can do this. Very, very fast breathing, high temperature. Um... A little bit of wheeze and pus and a little bit of cough, kind of upper respiratory thing. So uh, you have to kill anything in there. And then I'm going to need to give him some probiotics in his bottle on his next feeding, just to uh, make sure his rumen is working. We're not taking out any natural bacteria in there. So do that on the next feeding here. And it's going to be soon. All right, update on little Prince here. I don't know. Things aren't looking so great for him. Still waiting for the vet to call me back. Um, or text me back or something. He had a little energy to hop out of the box, which was good. Let me check the temperature. Ow. Okay, yep, I'm burning a hole in the couch. Crap! Oh, no. These are not meant for this. Oh. Dude, I'm glad I'm right here checking. Holy smokes. <laughs> oh, God. I'm glad I put it under the box and not under him. I thought it would give him a little bit of warmth because I didn't have a second heat lamp over here. And I mean, I have one. Oh, damn, my wife's gonna kill me. Jeez. Okay. <coughs> I just wanna cry. Okay. Oh. Those are obviously getting very hot. Um, man, oh man. Okay. Sorry about that. Let's focus. It smells like popcorn in here. Well, you were feeling pretty toasty, weren't you? I had it... Anyways, just so you know, I mean, I had it under the box, under a triple layered, uh, quadruple layered blanket here. Plus a double layered, another tea towel, and the box. So, and I did check the temperature of inside the box before I made that dumb move. Um, gosh. So he was very safe. My couch, however, was not. Um, so use chicken heater waterers for chicken heater waterers. And obviously don't put it on even some hay like my goodness that's a fire hazard um, it's like you gotta put it under a stone or something so with this feeding here I got the regular milk replacer and I got some probias in there it's not completely down and out last temperature we had was the 105.3 so I gave him a 
like a triple dose of antibiotics because he's been going downhill all day with the antibiotics and in my book I don't really see a difference if I if he's on the down and out I mean this is I've seen goats in much worse condition than this pop out so uh, my scared levelness right now for a little prince here is probably at like a a six um, if I check his temperature and it hasn't gone down at all it's gonna definitely creep up to a seven totally waiting for this vet um, the vets call back uh, we was in touch with him first thing this morning and he said everything I was already doing was exactly what he was gonna do so uh, I could screenshot you that too I know you've got some naysayers out there but um, I bought, you know, I don't know. Ooh, it smells. My wife's gonna kill me. Oh, jeez. Okay. <laughs> Here's your little hiney hole. See, what you want to do, though, is you want to make sure you get the right hiney hole. When I was first doing this, right up under the tail looks like the anus, but it's not. Yeah, I burnt the couch, Hannah. The anus is actually down on the lower half, right there. I don't like that smell. That's why I put it. Hannah, I burned the couch. Did you see it? Mom's going to kill me. Yeah, I just saw it. Okay. We're looking for anything lower than a 105.3. Oh, yeah. 103.6. I'm going to reset it and do it again just to make sure. <clears throat> At 103.8. Okay, so I'm just going to hold it in there for a second before I start it up. This thing seems to register the temperature a little too fast. Man, if I would have kept you in that box, you'd be 200 degrees. Oof. <laughs> okay, let's check it now. All right, 1038. I'm I'm okay with that. I'm that's improvement. That's improvement. Oy, 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 oy. That is not improvement right there. <laughs> I mean, at least you can clean up goat poop. How am I gonna clean that up? Oh my gosh. Well, my wife won't notice it for a while until she notices it. I'm going to put this little guy right here. Keep monitoring his breathing. I'm going to actually go get a heat lamp instead of a heat pad. That was my first experience with those um, chicken waters. It didn't come with any instructions, nothing. It didn't have anything. It's a black pad and a plug. I mean, and it comes in a plastic bag. Um, there's the rest of my couch right there. So, yeah, I'm super glad I decided not to go anywhere. Oy, 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 I'm dead. <laughs> 